Welcome back to another Shamshir Sound video. In this tutorial, we'll review how to manually install a VSD3 effect or an instrument in case there is no installer that comes with it. This will be with JS Inflator, a plugin that I reviewed recently. One of you guys asked on how to install it, but you can also do this for other VSD3 effects and synthesizers. Remember to smash up the like button and let's get started. Over on the GitHub for JS Inflator, you will just have to grab the .vst3 file. Once you have downloaded that, you just have to move it to the correct directory. So I'm going to copy this vst3 file and I will paste it in my default vst3 folder, which is C program files, common files, vst3. Back in FL Studio, we're gonna go into the plugin manager. I'm gonna go to add, more plugins, manage plugins, and I'm gonna click find installed plugins. This will do a scan with those default directories. In addition to custom directories, you can see these orange are custom ones that I've added. Now I'm gonna do a search. I'm gonna type in inflator and I can see this at the top. Now I installed it in the past, so it's probably gonna look like that without the star. So just make sure the star is on. We can also see a little bit more information here. Effect 64, VSD3, and now you're done. You can bring in the plugin a couple of ways. One way by right clicking on an empty slot. If I type in inflator, cause it was called inflator package, I can double click and bring it in. Or I can look for it on this list. If I press I on my keyboard, it went right to it automatically. If you wanna customize this list, I have a detailed video on how you can change things around, make categories, really clean this up and optimize the plugin list for your effects exactly how you like and the same methodology applies to instruments. You can also verify that it's VSD3 by clicking on the settings and go to VSD wrapper settings and you'll see here, VSD 3.7.7, 64-bit native. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick guide. If you did, remember to smash up the like button. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and that way you're alerted of the daily uploads and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.